hello, hello, and welcome to the channel. It's Michelle and Amelia. I am Michelle, your host, and we have a great movie review for you today. Well, it's Tis the Season to Be Jolly, and we have a great movie for you to watch over the holidays. Um, the name of the movie, the title of the movie, is called Catfish Christmas, and it is directed by Guess Who? The lovely Miss Victoria Roll of um, Young and the Restless Days, if you can remember. Um, she played the part of Drusilla Barber. She's directing. It is so nice to see her again, uh, just to hear her name uh, out there again. It's been a while since I've, I've seen Miss Roll. Um, in action. But anyway, this is a very nice, warm, wholesome Christmas movie. Um, it was the release date is December 1st, 2022. And um, it is one of the more realistic um, movies that I have seen in a while. Written by Miss Dara Harper. The movie stars Leanne Rose as Leslie, Tony Tom, Mr. Candyman. <laughs> he is Bob in this movie. He is the father. And Miss Ella Joyce, you remember her from um, The Rock back in the day? Um, she is the mother, Helen, in this movie. And Charlotte Evelyn Williams as the movie begins with um, Miss um, Leslie, who uh, is coming home, but previous uh, to her coming home, there's a flashback of her and her, at that time, her fiance, who had just proposed marriage to her. Um, the gentleman's name was Xavier in the film, but he got bulldozed into um, uh, breaking off the engagement with Leslie um, because the father feared that she was a gold digger. And by the way, the character Leslie is an accountant. She is um, um, about to be a partner in the firm. So, you know, a little bit of uh, judging the book by its cover is, is due in this particular scenario. But um, anyway, he breaks off the engagement with Leslie and um, she is absolutely in tears, of course, as you can, can believe. And she says that she just really does not understand how you can go from, you know, I want you as my wife and then now no we're not right for each other and so um, of course it's the usual thing she goes through this period of reconciliation from uh, being happy and going to being devastated so she packs it up and um, she gets ready uh, to go home for Christmas and um, I want to say this, the casting for the mother and father, um, Tony Todd and Ella Joyce, they have the bestest, <laughs> yes, I said bestest, they have the bestest chemistry as the matured couple. I mean, <laughs> I just really felt like it was a really, I could, it, this this particular um, Christmas um uh, uh, movie just really resonated me as realistic. They were totally believable. Oh, find anybody, anybody special, special yet? yet? Uh, Leslie's parents, and so um, of course they, um, in general, they're the natural parents that are concerned that she needs to hurry up and get married and 
uh, like they are and find a, a partner that will totally um, make her happy, okay? So um, she gets there and of course, she don't want to look at no man and the sister is, um, who is a, a great in this role, uh, Miss, Miss Williams as Faith. Um, Faith feels really bad and she wants her sister to be happy. And um, so she decides to pretend to be this football player that gets interested in Leslie just to, you know, raise up her, um, to raise her up out of, you know, the, the depths of, uh, defeat in relationships. So, um, that's when the fun begins. Um, the, I also want to mention that there is a person of interest um, in this particular, as with all Christmas movies, romantic Christmas movies, um, Debbie, uh, one of her childhood friends who he had this major crush on her um, since they were in high school and he is just absolutely elated that she is back home and yeah, he feels like this is my chance to get with the woman of my dreams. And so, um, the, however though, um, the sisters got something else in mind with this, this football player. And she, you know, uh, pulls some strings and she uh, goes online and pretends to be this football player that is getting interested in Leslie and it's really her, the sister, the young sister, young, her younger sister, Faith, that is pretending to be the football player, um, so that um, she will want to, to to awaken that desire in her sister to want to um, start over again after that that awful experience uh, with being jilted. But anyway. Um, uh, it's got a good plot. Um, this is one of, in my opinion, one of the better Christmas plot movies. It's, it's more realistic. It's a, you know, it's a little bit devilish and everything, but, you know, the, the younger sister's, uh, heart is really in the right place. And so, um, you know, hey, you can't beat that. <laughs> but anyway, she, um, uh, through a, 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 a series of trial and error and almost getting caught, um, she somehow manages to win a date uh, with this football player for Leslie. And um, that's when the romance begins between her and the football player. But where Devin comes in, um, Leslie wants uh, Devin to kind of uh, be her technical um, uh, man and, and uh, review if the, 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 it's a real thing that is happening between her and Devin and it's not some uh, trick or something. You know it is, but um, Devin was... Technically, it, it is real, but as the viewer, you'll see, no, it's not real. So, but in Devin's eyes, he was able to um, ascertain that um, the, the uh, profile of the person is a real person and blah, blah, blah. So it goes undetected. But at the same time, there is this um relationship that is starting between her and Devin um, who is by the way the neighborhood mixologist he <laughs> that's what he refers to himself as a mixologist and he's really a bartender and at first Leslie look, Leslie looks down on that and um, but anyway she uh, 
she comes around. So it's a great film. Um, I'm not going to tell the whole thing, but uh, you will enjoy it. It's a nice, um, very warm, um, homey type uh, Christmas movies you will enjoy. And it's, like I said, it's very realistic. And uh, the cinematography is great. Um, I enjoyed it quite a bit. So, um, I will definitely be giving this one a thumbs up. Um, and once again, so glad to see Victoria Royal um, directing. And the acting was very good. Anyway, if you have liked this movie review, please like and subscribe. And I will see you at the next It's Michelle in a Movie Review. And oh yes, please stay tuned. We will be discussing further details about the giveaway. And for everyone who is watching, have a very happy, safe, and blessed Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year.